Welcome. This is the summary for Turkish economy chapter 2, which is main economic indicators and income distribution and poverty. Let's start with uh, the shares of sectors in GDP in Turkish economy. When we look at agriculture, uh, we see that the share of agriculture is decreasing. Uh, it started with 9.1993 uh, in uh, 1998 and ended with 6.22 in uh, 2018. We have a stable uh, share of uh, GDP in terms of manufacturing. It started with 19.33 and ended with 19.78. An increasing trend for construction is seen, uh, which starts with 4.66 and ends with 7.20. And uh, for the last one, which is being services, we also have a stable uh, trend in share in terms of share uh, which starts with 56.63 and ends with 55.64 uh, in 2018 if we look at uh, the household uh, consumption expenditure uh, in terms of their share uh, we get this table, this figure actually, and uh, you can see here that food and non-alcoholic beverages account for 21%, housing and rent accounts for 24%, and transportation accounts for 16%. When we sum these three up, uh, we get 61%, which means in an average uh, household consumption in Turkey, uh, an average household in Turkey uh, spends 61.61% uh, of their income uh, to these three uh, goods and services, which are food, housing, and transportation, and these are basic consumption. So. Uh, we also uh, see that educational services account for 2% and also health accounts for another 2%. Um, these are uh, really small numbers uh, in comparison uh, with uh, food, housing and transportation. Uh, but these are uh, mainly due to uh, the social coverage. If you remember uh, from the previous video, uh, which was about uh, 71, uh, 81 million uh, people uh, as of 2018. <sighs> what we see here uh, in this figure is that uh, the components uh, of the GDP for Turkish economy starting from 1998 and ending in 2018. Uh, the blue line here which is C which is final consumption has a slightly decreasing trend and the yellow line has a uh, slight maybe more than a slight an increasing trend the yellow line I being investment. We have a stable trend in G which is public consumption and we have um, a wave, a stable trend but a wave in NX which is net exports. Um, in this table we see uh, we we'll look at long-run growth rates of real GDP per capita. Um, and 
This shows us that between 1923 and 2016, uh, the real GDP per capita uh, jumped from 1,000 and 242 uh, from 17,906 uh, with a 2.9% 2. 2. Uh, growth rate, uh, average growth rate per year in Turkey. Uh, this rate, this growth rate is uh, larger uh, than uh, many countries uh, which are uh, seen in here but uh, note that uh, let's say for the Switzerland the initial uh, level of uh, capita was this which is uh, 15,600 uh, and uh, 58 uh, in comparison uh, to Turkey uh, this is a much larger uh, value and a 1.4% uh, growth in uh, such a value uh, is actually higher than a 2.9% growth in this value. When we look at uh, employment level we see that uh, from 2005 and uh, to 2019 the total count of unemployed is increasing note that uh, this is not the share of unemployed this is not a ratio this is a total count similarly we have an increase in employed people in terms of total count of them uh, which we see in this area um, this table also shows us that uh, about 50 percent of uh, and even more uh, uh, percentage of the whole people employed is in services sector which we see in here and we also see that uh, in agriculture and construction we have first an increasing trend then a decreasing trend in terms of employed people count and when we look at inflation uh, we see that starting from 1970 and ending for in about 2003 or 2004 we have a high inflation era and you can see that in this year which is 1994 the rate uh, for inflation was 106.3% and we also see a slight increase in uh, inflation trend after 2016 uh, so uh, not as high as a previous era but uh, nevertheless we have an increase in inflation trend uh, lately in terms of income distribution, um, we see that wage and salaries and social transfers has an increasing have an increasing trend. We can see that in 2006, uh, the wage and salary, uh, the share of uh, wage and salaries uh, was 40.8 percent, and it became it jumped to 48.5 in 2018 similar uh, thing is true for social transfers which is in here jumped from 
20.7 to 22.8. In contrast, we have a decreasing trend in entrepreneurial, entrepreneurial gains and agricultural uh, income, which are located in here. And entrepre entrepreneurial gains uh, started with 24.2% and ended with 18.8%, while agricultural income started with 7.1% and ended with 